Happy Sunday. It's 10 a.m. and it's time for a brand new I Rate Your Teams video. For cheap, fast and reliable FIFA 20 Ultimate Team coins, check out u7buy.com and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off all of your orders. I'm actually really excited for this one. We've had winter refresh, brand new man of the matches. So, without further ado, let's jump straight into it and actually check out some teams. We're starting off with Joe's team. I'm getting Raul from Icon Swaps. The untradables are the Icons and Kubo and Valbuena. I've got 100k to play with. Uh, I play a 4 1 2 1 2 in game with Raul, Ben Yedda, and Striker. Keep the good work. Hey, thank you, man. Appreciate that. So, I'm guessing you're playing. So, Raul and Ben Yedda up top. You're playing Valbuena Cam. Now, this Raul, I'm guessing, is from Icon Swaps, right? Uh, you're going to get him from Icon Swaps. I honestly. I don't know about Raul in Striker with Ben Yedda. I think that might not be the, the greatest recipe for. Um, for success. Thinking about it, and thinking about the options you can get from Icon Swaps, um, I guess we can kind of have a quick delve into the uh, SBCs and see what we're looking at here. Um, if we scroll down, Raul is what, 11 tokens, if I'm not mistaken? Um, or 10 tokens. He is one of them, and I can't find him for some reason. Where is Raul? <laughs> These aren't in order, are they? They're not in order. Okay, that makes sense. Uh... I've got an ad for League of Legends. I need to get rid of that too. Raul's 10 tokens. So who can he get for 10 tokens that you can also use as a striker? I'm just trying to look for you now. Um, who are the options for 10 tokens? There didn't seem to be a lot. There's a... Okay, I can kind of see now why you're going for Raul. My my thought process was maybe going and looking at Lineker. Uh, Lineker looks like a solid card. 88 pace, 86 dribbling, 91 shooting. But I guess if like he's he's a good choice for for the amount of tokens you're gonna get. So I guess Raul's not the worst option. Uh, looking at this team though, I think Ben Yedder could be doing with an upgrade. You've got two Spaniards here, and you've got two icons. So you can literally go with anyone here at striker. You've got a hundred thousand coin budget. Uh, in terms of who you can go with, you can go with the new man of the match, then Max Amin, if you want to. If you're looking for a little bit of fun, you're looking for someone who's fast with good skill moves, maybe. Um, you can literally go with, let's have a look at uh, Strikers for 100,000 coins. This is a really good tool, by the way, guys. I highly recommend using it. Uh, what else can you go with? You can literally go with any of these Strikers. You can go with the 90 Lewandowski or the 91 Lewandowski if you're feeling someone like that. You can go with Griezmann. You can go with Aguero. You can go with Dybala. You can go with uh, Aubameyang if you want to. You can go with, hell, if you want it, you can go with Lukaku. You know, there's a lot of different options you can go with. Uh, what I would do is I would just have a look at different strikers you can go with. Um, pick one and then go with them. If I keep getting the same ad, I'm getting really angry by it now. Um, I'd just have a look at different different options you can go with, to be honest. You know, you can get the likes of someone like Kevin Gamero. I just think that Ben Yedda's normal card isn't good enough anymore. I would look to personally upgrade that right there. Um, and the rest of it's pretty nice. I mean, Kara off chem here. You could all, you could always go with someone at left left back that would help you out and get full chemistry maybe. Um, I'm sure there's different options. There's like a, a German left back. Maybe go with Schultz, uh, his new winter refresh card. I'm not entirely sure how much that card is, um, but I'm pretty sure it's not that expensive, if I'm not mistaken. It's 80,000 coins. So if you spent 20k on the striking, spend the 80k on Schultz and go with Schultz at left back, get a full chem on Kara and full chem on Coman as well. Um, but uh, yeah, apart from that, the team is, is a solid team, to be honest. Uh, alternatively, to swap uh, Guardiola and Valbuena, you get a full chem as well. So... You know, either of those uh, if you want to do it. All right. Next team now is coming from Shoy. 130k. Untradables are Salah, Allison, Guardiola. I finished Shane, not submitted it. Just wondering what you think. Uh, and what we what would you do to improve the bench uh, is untradable. I'm sorry. The, sometimes, like, my brain doesn't work properly. Just wondering what you think. Uh, just wondering what, what, what you would do to improve the bench. All right, there we go. I got it there. I'm, I got it in the end. Punctuation, grammar, sometimes it doesn't work with me. Um, interesting. I don't like the fact that you've got this team and, like, you're, you're sacrificing in positions to go with Sane. I don't think you submit Sane. I'll be honest with you. I think you can do a lot better here. Uh, so I'm guessing you're taking Hiero from Icon Swaps, which is a good move. You could always go, instead of, instead of submitting Sane, you could go with, um, the man himself, uh, Van Dijk at right centre-back as opposed to Laporte. It's not going to change the chemistry on Awa. He's still going to be on eight chemistry. Um, and then you could go with a different left mid. For example, you can go with 
maybe a, a special uh, Prem player. Uh, you could swap over Hierro and Van Dijk and go with um, a Spaniard at left mid. That gets a strong link. There's a lot of different options you can go with there. Or you could play someone at eight chemistry if you want to. Um, but I would say don't submit Sane when you're you're going for a much worse centre-back in Laporte, in my opinion. Um, next team is going to be from Thunder, who says, Hey, it's Haber. Really love the content. What do you think of my team? And do you have any suggestions? I've got 100,000 coins. The tradables are Madison, Allison, and Emerson. The rest of the bench is untradable. Much love from Canada. Hey, much love, dude. Thank you very much for watching the videos. I, I still find it crazy that you guys watch from all over the world. Uh, it's absolutely dope. I would love to visit Canada one day. That's one place I'd love to visit is, uh, is Canada. All right, so... Well, okay, this team's actually nice. I like I like the layout of this team a lot, actually. I think it's really cool. Uh, I think you've got great players and great positions. If I was to change anything on this team, I'll be honest with you. I actually wouldn't change anything. I would stick with this team. I, I, I think this team is very nice. I think you've got a very nice team here. I would say just work on eventually upgrading Seydorf to a better CDM style player. Uh, Seydorf is more of a box-to-box -box in my opinion. Um, and you've got two very similar CDMs in my opinion here. So I would say eventually just upgrade Seydorf to like maybe a middle icon. Uh, there's a lot of different options. You can go, you could even go with someone like a middle icon Desai. He's not great at dribbling and he's not great at passing. But as long as you have good dribblers and good passes around him, he's really, really good at just tracking runs, at uh, barging people off the ball at being an absolute monster at CDM. Trust me, I've used him. Um, so that could be a good option. And uh, no, to keep the rest of the team the same, it's very, very nice. Uh, the next team coming from Ruben uh, Barrett, who says, I've got only 90,000 coins at the minute. Could you just tell me where you'd upgrade for the future? I'm going to get a Kone Future Stars instead of Sanchez as I sub Sanchez straight away for Trossard. All plays untradeable uh, besides objectives for SBCs. Love the vids. Hey, thank you, man. All right. Where would I upgrade straight away? Um... I mean, really, you sub off that Sanchez. That's actually, I'm, I'm quite surprised. I mean, I'm guessing if you're playing Sanchez in an attacking role, where, where in is Sanchez? Okay, so you bring on Trossard. You're going to have a Kone there. I don't see any weak links on your team either. I'll be honest with you. Even like going in the future, I don't see weak links with your team. I see why you've got the Brazilian link here. Um, this link down the right is nice. The, the whole link up top is very, very nice. Uh, I guess like... Eventually, just upgrading that. Instead of getting a Kone, you could work towards Mbappe. And apart from that, the rest of the team is really solid in your positions. And the, the, something I'm really struggling with at the minute, guys, with the episodes is, is trying to help you guys with upgrades. Because a lot of you guys are starting to get to the point where your teams are becoming really endgame. But you don't quite have the coins because EA have made icons really inaccessible for the top tier ones. And I totally understand why non, no, no, none of you have the coins to get the likes of uh, a Prime Icon Moments Kaka or someone like that, you know, because they're like 10 mil. Um... So it's super difficult to suggest improvements because I know you guys have built the teams that you enjoy using. So I don't want to say, hey, get rid of, hey, how about you get rid of Politano and you go something completely wacky and go with Dembele down there or something, you know? Because like, I don't want to change your teams too much. I think this is this is more for the for the lesser teams that need improvement. So for this team, I honestly wouldn't improve anything else. Uh, if you think that a certain position is super weak, then try to work on that position. But I can't see any positions in this team that are super weak, to be honest. Uh, the next one is coming from Brad, who says, I've got 150k for upgrades, and I'm thinking of saving up for one of these teams. Uh, I'd love your input on tradable. Only tradable is Mole. Uh, keep the good work. Hey, thank you, man. So, you think, oh, okay, you've had some pretty decent luck over here with the Stoichkov, the, the uh, Guardiola and Zambra, I'm guessing, from Icon Swaps. I like the look at, like, the layout of this team is actually really cool. Um, let's have a look at this one. So, I was going to suggest a Kone anyway. Um, let's have a look at this one. No, no Benyeda for me, mate. No Benyeda for me. So what I would do is I would go for this team here. But instead of getting Sanchez at Cam, I would personally look to get somebody else at Cam. Uh, who you got on the bench? You've got Talisa. Yeah, you've got no one really good on the bench. Um, I would go with this one. And then as a central Cam, you could go with a whole host of different players, actually. You could go with a brand new uh, upgraded Sarabia. Now, if you guys didn't know, brand new Man of the Matches came out last night. Um, and Sarabia got an upgrade on his wants to watch. So his wants to watch is now 85 rated. You could give this card a go. Uh, it doesn't look like the world's best card. But as a central cam, he's got good dribbling. He's got good passing. He's got decent uh, uh, shooting. He's got decent pace. You know, he's, he's left footed, but with four star, four star. Uh, he could be a good option as your central cam here. Gets the link with Guardiola to get him onto full cam. Um, you know, that could be a good option. Or you could put a Kone in the middle and go with anyone at left uh, left cam. That's from um, that's from the league. 
Uh, but I'd definitely go with this setup. This setup is definitely the best out of all of those. The next one coming from uh, Suds, Suds LX one who says, I have 60k to spend. Mane, Vardy, and Roussillon are untradeable. I play the 4 and 2 and 2 narrow in game. Who could I pick for six tokens in swaps? Uh, thoughts on the team, by the way. Love the vids. Um, well, it's a nice team. For, for six tokens in swaps, I mean, you only have like three choices, right? I'm pretty sure you only have Hierro, uh, Moore, and, uh, and Van der Sar. I mean, I would go Hierro just for the sake of going with Hierro. I wouldn't even replace Longley with Hierro. Uh, you've got a shadow on Longley. He should be good enough. I'd swap Varane and Longley, though. You want the left the left footer on the left side. This team is super nice. I think the only thing I'd change in this team is Vardy. Now, looking at it as well real quick, I'm pretty sure that Ndidi, this might be an old screenshot because Ndidi's now 86 right here, doesn't inform. Um, that card looks absolutely incredible. So that's a GG on that. You said you'd play the 4 and 2 on two narrow. You've got a really defensive midfield here for 4 and 2 and 2 narrow. I would maybe change your left CDM here. Uh, I'd probably change Decore for Pogba. He's a bit more of an attacking box to box. I see why you've got Vardy as well. Obviously, you need the the uh, the link. Um, one thing you could potentially do for the near future. Now, this is something you have to save up for. You could go with the brand new Akotcha or a version of Akotcha. I don't know how much the icon moments Akotcha is. It's going to be pretty expensive, uh, but it's going to be something you can aim for in the uh, in the far future because this card looks really, really nice. To be honest, so does this one. This one's 550k and this one looks equally as nice. Five-star skills, four-star weak foot. Um, the only downside is 79 finishing, but you could play him at cam and play, uh, play Dembele and Mane up top. Um, he'd also get the strong link with uh, Ndidi, so that would be a good shout there. Um, but that's just something I think you save up for in the future. Um, but no, the, t the rest of the team though is really nice, and uh, GG on getting the uh, Ndidi before he got an upgrade. Um, the next team is coming from Aimbot Yoda, who says, I've got 300k to spend. The Heia, PK, Kubo, Iniesta, Benzema, and Ikone are, uh, is untradeable, are untradeable. I play uh, PK, a <laughs> 4 triple 2 in game, love the vids. I got Dembele instead of Benzema. Okay. Wait, what? I got Dembele instead of Ben. I am so confused. I don't know what you mean by that, so I'm going to completely ignore that. Because, I mean, I think you mean Dembele, the future stars Dembele, which doesn't make any sense because you've got the picture with Benzema. Okay, I'm going to guess that you've gone with the future stars Dembele there. What a change with this team. It's hard to say. What do you say you play? You play a 4 triple 2 in game. Who are your CDMs? Like, what? I This team confuses me, mate. I'm sorry. I don't really want to sit here and critique your team because I don't get how you play at all. You don't have any CDMs in this entire team, but you play with two CDMs um, and you've got a different player. I'm going to scroll past it because I don't want to comment on it because I don't actually understand the team. Um, I don't want to tell you to change stuff that will make absolutely no sense to your team. The next one is coming from Reese, who says, This is my team. All the benches are untradeable as well as a team. I have 400,000 coins after these two players, and I'm out. Uh, and I'm five out of six on hazard segments. I play uh, four, two, three. What you play? Wait, five out of six? Oh, sorry, the SBC. I play four, two, three, one. Drug at Hazard, uh, Via, and CL7 is cams. Uh, love the vids. Give the good work. Okay, check it out. So you play a four, two, three, one. Drug at Hazard, Via. I mean, I think that means striker. Drogba striker, Hazard, Veer, and CL7 cams. Uh, I don't actually rate CL7 as a cam. I'll be honest with you. Um, now, I'm guessing he's tradable, and that's a million coins right there. I would work on someone else other than uh, than Ronaldo there, to be honest, mate. What I would do is, I know you've got Danilo, but I think it's time to get rid of Danilo. I think it is. What I would do is, I would go with Messi at right mid. Then I'd go with Emerson, the right back. Uh, this Future Stars right back over here. Get him and get Messi at right mid uh because he'll play much better as a cam um and then obviously you go with loddy and uh and hazard over here at the left side as well i think that's probably a good shot a good shout because uh i don't think cr7 would be a good cam that's from someone that's got an untradeable ronaldo i just don't think he'd be a good cam the next one coming from jake uh this is my team i've got 150k my whole team is tradable apart from courtois more rykard and james seconds in game any suggestions keep with the good work well thank you man appreciate that uh let's check it out so hmm that's interesting, actually. I like this link over here on the right. You've got the new Decore. Um, you're playing this in-game. Okay. Pogba is a central, CD, uh, central attacking mid. I'm not a big fan of, personally, but that's just my personal preference. I, you know, that Vardy card would probably perform better than his uh, Play of the Month card. A lot of you guys tell me, like, people are so mixed on that Play of the Month Vardy. This card seems to be 
how how many how much better than the player of the month is it? It's got player of the month has got wait the player of the month is eighty seven rated now. Look, he's in games. See, for me, it's just the fact that he can't dribble, and his strength is only seventy two, and it's like I, I don't know. I don't know. That's just the thing for me. It just feels really clunky, but you guys are super, super conflicted on it. Uh, some of you guys love him. Some of you guys hate him. What I would say with this team is I'd probably try and get someone other than Pogba as your central cam. Maybe wait until we... I mean, we're not getting a once to watch Bruno Fernandes, are we? Uh, maybe get the normal Bruno Fernandes as a central cam. He'll get the link to Dan James. Um, that could be a decent shout. Uh, you know, you could... Apart, no, apart from that, I think I think just do that, to be honest. I don't think the rest of the team's nice, to be honest. Um, next one coming from Nicholas who says I got 155k all SBC and icon minus Nakata wait all SBC and icons minus Nakata I'm guessing that means are untradeable I play 40 for one in game I'm willing to save up bloody vids bro. thank you very much man uh, let's check it out so Nakata is a central camera it's not too bad hmm what would I do with this team I would say just save to get a better central cam Maybe get yourself a baby Zola. Maybe get yourself a Del Piero. Maybe get yourself a... How even middle Sto uh, baby Stoichkov cover be a decent shout here. There's a lot of different really good icons you can go with. Just try and figure out what your play style is and, and fit one in based on your play style. The rest of the team, I wouldn't change, to be honest. I think the rest of the team is very, very nice. Uh, the next team coming from Flappy Bird is says, Hey, Haber, hey, Sandro and Fabinho are the only tradable second pixel playing game. I've got 100k to spend, but could grind for more. Keep it the good work. Well, thank you, man. Appreciate that. He's got the Maya. That's the, the, the first person I've seen that uses the Maya. Fair enough. Um, that team looks really sick. That This team looks like it's got a fantastic layout. I'm not going to lie, mate. I really like this a lot. I wouldn't change literally anything apart from upgrading Sandro to his uh, Team of the Year nominee. And then the rest of it, I would, I would keep the same pretty much, mate. The rest of this team is sick. The rest of the team is very, very nice. Uh, next one coming from John James. Uh, love the vids. All in was apart from CDMs and goalkeeper. I've got 150k improvements. Uh, and I'm currently doing icon swaps. I play with this in game. Hope you see it. Let's check it out. Okay. Play the same in game. Ooh, I'm not a fan of that. Not a fan of that at all. Um, Remy, for me, seems super clunky. Um, Alwa wouldn't be a bad central cam. I think you go Alwa central cam and try and get a Kone as your right cam. Uh, the rest of the team is very nice. I like the rest of the team. Maybe getting rid of Kolarov for a better left back. Maybe an inform Hernandez uh, or a team of the nominee Sandro. Um, they would both be good shouts in my opinion. But yeah, no, the rest of the team is nice. I would say I'd keep the rest of it the same. I'd just say, yeah, get a Kone and get yourself Sandro um and and your team is massively massively upgraded and the last one for this episode is going to be from dylan lamb hey ryan i've got 500k for upgrades and oshman remy orsic lala and and courtois are untradeable as well as the bench i play four triple two in game with oshman and remy up top I sub off tovan and mubanje for alan and mendy been loving the vid uh be sorry beloved the content recently have a great day well thank you very much bro i appreciate that and uh my brain had a bit of a fart there, but we're good. We are good. So you bring off... Okay, so you bring off the left back here and you bring off um, Tovan. Interesting. I wonder... Mm, no, actually, I take that back. Hmm. How many coins did you say you had again? Let me just double check that. 500k for upgrades. Ooh la la. I would say for upgrades, first things first... Um... I'm trying to think of French right back, uh, right centre back, Goose. I think that I, I'll be honest with you, Edem Militao is super OP, but I think Longley's better. Uh, I would also say that. I mean, no, the rest of the team's nice. I mean, you bring off, so you bring off uh, Tovan for um, Allen. I'm just trying to think if anyone can go. You could try and get Baby Makalele, who would play pretty similarly to Allen. Doesn't have the the dribbling or the four star skill moves, but you can start him and change him in game. It, it saves you a sub. Um, the more subs you can save at the start, the better, in my opinion. So I would, I would maybe try out Baby Makalele, to be honest. I get Longley and Baby Makalele, and uh, and the rest I keep the same. And that's it for this episode. If you guys have enjoyed, please leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here. Thank you all for the epic support recently. You guys are amazing. My brain wasn't working. I apologize. Sometimes in these episodes, they just I try and talk too fast, and my brain can't keep up. I do apologize for that. But thank you all for watching, and I'll see you later.